We got a relay board off of a freeze dryer on the workbench today and we're going to replace all the relay switches on it. Now the tools that I'm going to use, I'm going to use some flux, I'm going to use some desoldering braid, and of course I've got the new relay switches over here, and I do have a desoldering gun, but I'm going to show you with the braid first because that's pretty cheap to get and it's pretty effective too. And then I'm going to use my desoldering gun on the remainder ones just to speed things up. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put some flux on the points that we're going to desolder. I'm just going to take some of our braid. We're just going to hold it right there where we're trying to remove the solder from. Now you can add a little bit of flux to your wick and that does help. Okay, we're going to move on to the next ones. Add a little bit more flux to it. It's going to kind of go around it, try to get all the solder out of the hole. Take some time, just be patient. Just keep working your way around. Once you think you've got enough solder off of them, you can try to wiggle the part out. Seems like it's still pretty stuck.
Just making sure the pins, if they wiggle a little bit, then you know that you've got them free. I'm going to add some solder back to this one because it seems like it's not coming out of the hole. Try to draw it up again. Looks better. There you go. First one out. I'm going to take some rubbing alcohol and a toothbrush, clean some of that flux up. All right, for the next one, we're going to use our desoldering iron. These are really nice to have, but they are quite expensive. Yeah, see if we can get it out. Just like that. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take the remainder ones off. I'm just gonna speed this part of the video up. Okay, now that we've got all the switches removed, let's go ahead and clean the work area. We're going to go ahead and put our first replacement switch in. There's only one correct way to put it in there and it's only going to go in one way. Alright, you're just going to have to hold the switch on. Get a little solder on there. I'm just going to do one side and we're going to tack in one on the other side the way it holds it in there nice I'm just going to go through and do each pin okay we're going to go ahead and grab our next switch Some flux. Tack it in. Hit these contacts. Make sure you don't do them. Chase, which is like flat. Okay, we'll go ahead and speed it up for the remainder ones. Okay, now we've got all our switches installed. Let's go ahead and clean the work area.
Okay, there you have it. All the switches have been replaced. I'm gonna go ahead and package this up and ship it back out to my buddy and hopefully his freeze dryer will be good as new again. Thanks for watching the video.